Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and this is the Lord's Word for us today. I was driving home and saw a sign that made me stand up and take notice. The incredible thing is, I had driven by this sign many, many times, but this day it took new significance. The sign said, Coming Soon. Now, we see signs everywhere, and they become mundane and just part of the landscape. But the Lord reminded me, when I saw this sign, that He is coming soon. In fact, His coming is closer than any of us could possibly imagine. When you check your Bible and study the signs of His coming, you see how close His coming really is. The freakish weather patterns, the wars, the rumors of war. Right now, over 40 wars are being fought right now. The most visible, of course, is ISIS. And we see the West and Russia again on a crash course. It's as bad as it was any time that we were in the Cold War. These signs once remind us that every day we live, we are one day closer to the coming of the Lord. During this time period, I have become more and more aware of the frailty of life. When you start seeing family and friends dying, it awakens you to your own mortality. You realize that you're only on this planet for such a short period of time. So it's imperative that you do two things. Number one, prepare for eternity and make sure that every day that you live, you impact your world. One of the people of my church had just retired after 40 years in the same job. He was excited about two things. First of all, he had more time to do what he wanted to do and also had a chance to volunteer and make an impact on his world. I like that thought. The challenge I have for you and I today is that we need to believe that the Lord is coming back soon. Don't wait until you have more time. Make your impact today. Do the little things that make the difference. Do an act of random kindness. Visit someone. Phone someone up and encourage them. Do it now because you may not have a chance later. My neighbor, a man who was in his early 60s, contacted cancer. By the time he learned he had, he found out he had no hope. Within three weeks, he was gone. There was little time for anything else but to focus on battling the cancer and preparing for his death. The lesson I learned was from this. Do the things that last for eternity, be, now before eternity takes you, and there's no time left. Remember, coming soon to a planet near you is Jesus Christ. Do what you can right now, and when he comes, be ready. My name is Robert Dean Steele. You have yourself a great and godly day. This is the Lord's Lord for you today.